Welcome to our third and final session on the Vantage and Fusion Design Center Library. This session is designed to assist you in managing your library files so that you can bring your library objects forward on Design Center version upgrades, port from one computer to another, and collaborate with Vantage, coworkers, or others to share valuable library objects. We'll begin by examining the location of the library file. As we open a file explorer, our intent is to arrive at the Design Center Program folder, which is found under the local disk, Program Files x86, Vantage, and then the appropriate Infusion Design Center folder. For me, that is the version 3.2. Within this folder, you will find two files with the extension .dcl. The first, Vantage Factory Library, is the intact version of the library as it installed on your computer. The second, Vantage Library, is derived from the first version but modified as you insert objects into the library. If for some reason you ever need to revert to the original, you could move or delete the second file and a new version of that file will be automatically created again as a duplicate of the first the next time you open Design Center after a computer reboot. And you can begin to modify again from that point. If you have multiple versions of Design Center, each version's folder will have two files identically named. When you install a new version of Design Center, your older library does not come forward to the new version. However, you can easily merge your custom objects from previous version libraries to the current version through the Merge feature. A library merge is done by clicking on the Merge icon at the top of the library pane selecting the desired library file and then selecting those objects I want to merge. Don't just merge everything because you will get duplicates, just those things that you want. What we just demonstrated was a merge of objects from our previous version library to our current version. The exact same merge process is used for sharing between objects between coworkers and for inserting objects that will be made available to you from Vantage into your library. You will simply need to access a copy of the library file that has the objects you want to merge into your library. You might keep a master library somewhere, somewhere on your network storage for all your employees to access. This concludes our third and final session on the Vantage and Fusion Library. Hopefully you have caught a glimpse of the power of the library, its potential to reduce the time you spend in system programming and verification, and to increase your consistency. Vantage is dedicated to providing the tools to empower integrators to provide better systems while increasing productivity. And we believe that the library is an important software tool to achieve these ends. Future instructional videos and shared objects will build upon this understanding of the library. We hope that you will watch for these and that they will help you be successful in your business.